Hello, it's Martin here from Man of Yard. So this is quite an uncomfortable location to be filming this, but it's just a short um, introduction video, really. Um, so a couple of weeks ago, I went to Dorset to visit a friend uh, with my brother as well, and we went on a few trips out to see Cough Castle and other beautiful parts, and around Swanage, had a walk up around the area as well. And uh, one of the highlights was to visit Brownsea Island. And so this video is just a series of footage from Brown Sea Island, really. Um, the main objective was to find red squirrels, because all three of us had never seen a red squirrel before, even though we were all 26 or 27, which is quite a, a sad thing to think about, the fact that we are our own native species of squirrel. You just don't see them anywhere anymore, and you have to go so far to kind of see them. Um, Brown Sea Island has red squirrels on it because it is an island and so it's almost like a Donald Trump thing that isn't it? It's an island um, and all the grey squirrels that have invaded kind of a country and took over the habitats of the reds uh, weren't able to get across and so it's this one little pocket where they thrive you see. Um, the island history itself is interesting um, because at one time it was a base of King Canute in 1015 who actually went across to Sack Wareham, which is the uh, the town that featured in my last video. And also, it's where the Scout Movement was formed as well. So there was a man called uh, Baden Powell, who founded the Boy Scouts, and he would teach them all kind of bushcraft skills and camping skills, and then get them around a campfire and tell them all about his experiences in colonial Africa and things. Which sounds to me like a real kind of self-indulgent um, uh, <laughs> pastime, but also really cool. And I was in Scouts myself, of course, but it probably wasn't as awesome as when Baden Powell was doing it, because my Scout leader probably wasn't that inspirational. He was just a, a fat guy called Tim who lived with his mum and got us to play football and do eating competitions, so I didn't really learn anything at Scouts. So, but that's probably a sign of the times. Um, but yeah, the footage is really nice, so I hope you enjoy it. There's a little bit of wind noise, I do apologise for that. Hopefully one day I'll be able to get a better technology. At the moment I'm sat in this little cramped uh, corner because um, I'm in Rachel's room in York and I'm just currently um, packing for my sky holiday with her. So that should be good and there should be footage of that coming up as well. I was thinking of maybe doing like a sort of a half vlog kind of thing, uh, fingers crossed. Um, so yeah, and so I'm kind of in this crowded room amongst Rachel's big plant collection, trying to get Pat and things ready to set off tomorrow. So uh, look out for that. Uh, if a video is posted next week in advance, um, that's actually a video from last year's holiday about the Isle of Mull. So that's what will be coming up next next week. So I'm going to try to crack those out so I can get on with the Sky videos, hopefully. So yeah, I hope you're all well. and. Um, have a lovely weekend. See you in a bit.